everybody? This is Jay Buzzsaw. 79 have not done any X-Wing videos for a while. Uh, real quick as to why. Uh, it made it worse. I'm doing the, uh, what is it, the ADMW uh, on Octagon. So I'm doing a tournament there. So I had to get all my decks ready uh, for that. And uh, I also bought a house. So we're kind of getting stuff ready for the move. So, busy, busy. Uh... Just putting a few videos up here for you. Uh, get things ready. So, we'll get right into her. Today will be a Imperial build for you. Uh, so, we'll just slip right into that. Alright. So, yeah, uh, running here. Just the Decimated Patrol Leader. Pilot skill of three, three dice turret, uh, so the 360. Uh, no defense dice, because decimated, we don't care about that. Uh, 12 hull, uh, four shields with the torpedo, three crew, and mine, uh, with focus target lock for 40 points. Um, put Vader on, uh, just kind of push early damage through. Um, it's not so bad to take two if you're making a kill shot or hopefully put a good critical in. Uh, the mix, so that's alright. Um, uh, to go with that, of course, the Moth here. Uh, when you're Delta Face Up card, you can sacrifice either himself or another crew uh, to keep that card flip face down. No effect is resolved. Uh, and then for zero points, throw the Curier Droid on. Uh, the start of the place forces, you can treat your uh, pilot skill as either 0 or 8. Why not knock it up to 8, see if you can place before there's stuff to kind of get a feel for the spot on the map. That's kind of my idea with that. Um, so yeah, I mean, why not? Uh, now, I know some people probably tell me, well, you know, Vader with this is kind of silly, but... Uh, essentially here you're negating two crits for point of peace and uh, you know um, I need something to be firing so let's go grab our other ship here we'll have to back off a little bit here right, let's just bring her back a little bit all right Oh, maybe too much. That's right, do the best I can with what I got. Alright, so, we got Captain Unicoon. So he's got pilot skill 4. Still a decimator. Uh, the only difference down here is we got an EPT. He's for 42 points. After executing a maneuver, uh, uh, too many cards. Uh, each enemy ship you are touching receives or suffers one damage. So you can just put this out there in case anybody doesn't know. You can actually deal more than one damage if, for example, both ships were parallel to you and you drove over both. Uh, and you could backtrack and basically still be on both until the point that you drop off from, you know, basically backtracking from the bump, then the ruling is both ships would take a damage. Um, if you overlap, basically two ships and one slightly off kilt, and you back up, okay, well, I can't do that one. You back up a little more, and then you finally drop off. The ship that you last touched is the one that takes the damage, just so we're clear on that. So it is possible. Uh, so put Dauntless title on after you execute a maneuver that causes you to overlap. Uh, you may perform a free action by receiving a stress. So what that does is allows you to run somebody over, deal them a damage, take a stress, and then perform an action right afterwards, which includes Daredevil. So if you, you uh, can take an action to execute a white maneuver um, and then receive a stress. Uh, then if you do not have the boost... Uh, you roll two attack dice and take hits and crits, basically. Uh, but, since we're able to, we put the engine upgrade on, which adds the boost. So the bottom half of Daredevil does not apply to us. So you go ahead, you overlap. 
um, you take uh, one stress to activate Dauntless, and then you go ahead and activate Daredevil uh, to take another stress, and then smash him in the face again. And uh, at that point, it's kind of up to you. You can continue take another stress after that, so you'd be triple stressed. Um, if you wanted, you could also pull off the moth from the other one, and then put another inspiring recruit here for another point, which once per round, when uh, a ship, which is you, a friendly ship at range one or two, removes a stress token, you remove an additional one, so that would allow you to remove all three of these with one green maneuver. Of course, carrier droid, because again, it's free, so uh, why not? It is limited. Uh, but what that means to people who don't know is that you can uh, only have one per ship. You can have multiple in a build, but only one per ship. So basically what they're trying to do is make sure that somebody doesn't run multiples of these uh, and put them basically like have them off and then run two of these because basically you're negating three crits then for two points. Uh, so just a little something here. Uh, I really liked this before. Uh, my wife flew... Double decimator, oh, what's the double decimator? It was decimator, quick draw, and I think two or one or two academy pilots ties. I can't be sure it'd be 100%, but uh, she flew that and well, uh, yeah, she did pretty good and enjoyed it. So I'm going to give this a try. Uh, this is jbuzzsaw 79 saying thanks for watching, appreciate it, and please watch again for more stuff coming your way.